not all gay men that are young will cheat, and there certainly are exceptions for that. However, it happens a lot, and it's very, very easy for the gay community, young or old, to develop sexual addiction with clubs, with bars, with sex clubs, with internet dating. It's very, very easy for people to have sort of a, like, on to the next attitude, or they want to try one thing, and then they want to try the next guy. And guys are really attractive, and there's a lot of different types, and I think a lot of people want to try different personality types, different people types, different body types, and they really want to try multiple types, and a lot of gays are in open relationships and a lot of younger guys do want to cheat they do want to play the field they do want to date they do want to feel like they are attractive and yeah as statistically i would imagine that a lot of guys in their 30s and 40s are a lot more likely to be able to settle down it's good that some young guys are able to settle early and i imagine i maybe could have been that way myself i was fighting to kind of keep relationships going in my younger relationships and they were sort of fighting to get rid of it and that was my experience with my three young relationships that i consider relationships and my two older relationships were more committed and fighting to keep it and gay people sort of it's like they evolve a little bit differently with relationships anyway because you know most people i know we're not dating someone in high school. I mean, it's possible, and some do, but a lot of gay people won't even tell anybody they're gay until college in the first place, or, or start dating until college. I've known people that wait until after college, 25, 30s, before they start dating, and for some people, they need to wait longer, and when they wait longer, their emotional maturity and their dating maturity is usually slowed as well. And as for the young people that do date early, they still need to kind of play the field for a while a lot of times. They need to figure themselves out. They need to f figure dating out. They, they need to figure being gay out because it's different than being straight in a lot of ways. The, the sex is different. The relationships are different. The complications are different. Some people are closet. Some people are not. And people have a lot of things they want to figure out before they can kind of settle down and, and just be married with one person. You know, but the important thing also to know is that every single gay person is different. Not all of us are feminine. Not all of us want open relationships. Every gay person is different. But there is a lot of young people that want to fool around with lots of people. That that's just that might be a little bit of a stereotype or statistic, but we see it a lot. We see it a lot with clubs with people hitting on people. We see it a lot. I think everywhere. But it's good that there are some young people that are better than that as well.